This morning we've been searching around for uh, something to eat and it seems like everyone opens at around like 8.30 or so. Um, I think instead of the hotel breakfast we're going to go trek out to this place called The Smoothie Shop which is right beside Saffron where we ate last night. So that's what we're going to do. Lunch. Now we gotta pick up our laundry. We're about to go to the Ritz Carlton to meet up with Luke's friend Dan. And I'm not gonna bring the camera along because it's probably gonna be pretty boring. Just sitting around the pool talking. And that's about it. Well, I'm back from the day, and I uh, really wish I had taken the camera with me because it's a pretty amazing time. We met up with Luke's friend Dan, and Dan ha is staying at this like pretty amazing resort called Avaya. 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 You got to check that out. It's amazing. Um, there's insert this. Here. Ins yeah, insert a picture here. We took some pictures, but. I didn't have the camera, so no foot no film footage. But uh, it was really beautiful, and then we took this like elevator down to the water. It was like rocks all around us, and like a giant cliff, and beautiful scenery, and delicious food. And I learned that I really like Bali High beer, and we had some champagne. Uh, Dan has a cush job at Bloomberg, so he paid the bill, so we didn't have to worry about that. And then, uh, what I really didn't capture tonight was the sort of amazing adventure of riding the scooters at nighttime on these, like, Bali back roads, which was pretty crazy. Uh, and now someone's knocking on my door, so I'm gonna have to stop this. Alright, so I'm back. So. Yeah, the most exhilarating part of the journey that I haven't been able to capture yet is just riding scooters around the back roads of Bali. Like, the roads are pretty tattered in certain areas, but it's a pretty amazing experience just sort of cruising around on a scooter. It's even more amazing after a couple of Bali highs in Champagne and staying at a fancy resort. Um, yeah. Jumped in the pools. Oh yeah, we jumped in the pool and the water was the perfect temperature. Uh, so far, yeah, the Gato Gato is really great in Bali. Everything's been pretty amazing. Crispy tempeh? Crispy tempeh tonight. Uh, we went to this place that's like right around the corner. Uh, I don't actually remember the name, but they had Gato Gato and crispy tempeh. And it was pretty delicious. Uh, hopefully, yeah, I'm not going to make the mistake again of not bringing the camera along because it seemed like that was like the perfect opportunity to take some footage because the scene, scenery was so beautiful on the side of the cliff, but 
I will try to insert some pictures to tell the story. This is the fancy place we were at yesterday. They gave me a rose to give to Kate because I think they misinterpreted that we want to get married from we are married. So this guy came over he was like, can I borrow you for a second? And I was like, uh, a little weirded out. And then he, around the corner he gave me a rose to give to Kate. So I pretended to put those again. It was pretty funny. And his name was Krishna. And, and his name was Krishna. And he asked us to get him a good review Exactly. And he asked for us to get him a good review on Travel Advisor. Correction, Trip Advisor. temple and watch some dancing. protecting us from the monkeys and uh, wanted some money for that but we uh, we're not participating so going to the dance now to Dan and Jillian any idea what time it is? 5.32 so the dance starts at 6. Totally gonna miss it. Found a seat. It's pretty freaking crowded though.